So, um, thank you for um, for, for coming. Um, it's um, it really is good to see uh, so many of you uh, here tonight. Basically, this is the um, the, the, the program um, of, of things that we're doing uh, tonight. Um, so, um, there will be um, a break um, after um, the cycle route um, uh, talk. So, if you, if you know if you need uh, to have a break, then we'll have a, a sort of five minute break there. Um, Hopefully, uh, each of these um, will be useful um, to uh, to your studies. Um, so, the first um, thing that we want to um, to do is the David Smith Prize. Now, um, David Smith was uh, an external uh, sorry was the course consultant um, for criminology courses um, at UCBC, um, and he retired in 2012. Um, and um, to mark um, the, um, the work that David did, that's both with myself and both with uh, some of your other tutors as both undergraduate students and postgraduate students, um, he really did inspire um, a lot of, you know, a lot of the beliefs that we have, we can attribute to, to David. Um, you know, I'd like to think that if, if you get some kind of experience of education like I've got from David, then uh, I, I know that you know, we'll have done a decent job. Um, because David was always encouraging us to do things uh, and to have the belief and to have the confidence from somebody like David with his, his record of publications and um, it really did mean something. So, basically, as I say, this is what the, um, the, the award is. Now, this year's um, <coughs> award, uh, as we can see there, is to um, Laura, Laura, Laura Trainer. Um, and the reason why um, Laura was uh, specifically given the award was for, for many things, but particularly was for um, what she did, um, what she did there with regards to the uh, Crown Prosecution Service. Um, last year, the Crown Prosecution Service uh, undertook a public consultation into um, when prosecutions um, should be taken with regards to um, comments and things said on social networking sites. Now, Laura took it upon herself um, to, uh, com you know, to uh, engage with the uh, Crown Prosecution Service, and uh, at page 13, um, she's, um, you know, she, she is cited there. And it's only going to be brief, but when we just click on this link, and we see the kind of people that did take part. So I'm pleased, um, you know, when you get a chance to, to, to read this, because uh, hopefully many of you have got opinions about this thing. And obviously, yeah, it's been in the news recently um, about, you know, about the sentences uh, to, for people in, in conducting trolling kind of behaviour online. Um, so it, it is a current issue. Um, but we were so proud. I'll uh, just get to the... The people that took part... So, they, 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 to start with, these were the academic people um, that, that, that um, took part in the CPS consultation. So I think it's important to recognise that the Crown Prosecution Service does not dictate um, things. It does consult with the public. It is, it is led with the public. So these academics all um, took part. Uh, these are the groups from the media, from the legal profession, these different organisations. And again, when you realise this, then maybe you might look at the Crown Prosecution Service in a different way when you see these kinds of... Um, Communication, and then here we are. Laura Trainer that was there. Now this is the first time in uh, you know 18 years of doing criminology courses uh, at Blackburn that we've had a uh, student do this um, this kind of thing. So um, this is why we wanted to um, award the prize to Laura. So um, if we could ask Stuart to um, present the award with Laura and to take a photograph. Um, <coughs> then that'll be this part of the event over. Hello, Laura. Thank you. 